picture okay. of you and Kevin McCollum in front That's of the right. Motown on Broadway. So tell us a little bit about what Kevin's actual position is. I'm sure that his title isn't King of Broadway, but it might as well be, right? Um, <laughs> well, Kevin is the, the producer. He's one of three producers of Motown. There's Barry Gordy, there's uh, who was the founder. Of mine, of course, there's Doug Morris, who is the head of the Universal Music Group, and Kevin McCollum, and that's it. When I finally got to work with Kevin at that level, um, it, it was uh, it was the kind of experience, you know, that as an artist, you want to have that experience again. Right. You want to have it all the time, every time, because his notes, his input, his creative input is completely, um, you know, it's just it's just invaluable. And the more you follow it, the better your show. Away. So I'll say that. Well, the more and, you follow it, the better your show will be. And it really is about uh, his vision because, you know, I jokingly began this broadcast. Uh, Gabe, you can go on to the next picture that's David and Barry Gordy. Uh, I began this by saying uh, we all met when Kevin was a young man playing our pad and she loves me. But even then, yeah. he had this ferocious vision of what yeah. was achievable in the world of theater. And, you know, while yeah. we were all still friends, he put himself through the mm -hmm. Stark Peter program Stark. at USC, program. where he really learned mm -hmm. the nuts and bolts of high-end movie producing. And yeah. from that, he went to New York and just took New York by storm. I mean, he's the producer of Rent, Avenue Q. I mean, you, you can, you, can you name a few of those things? I don't even know. Yeah, well, I mean, they'll get a program. But yeah, Rent, In the Heights, um, the Boz Lerman La Boheme, Hand to God, which just opened, which is a brilliant play, Something Rotten that just opened, which is an incredibly brilliant, hilarious uh, new American musical. And, and he's committed to supporting artists on Broadway uh, in a way that if you looked at what the landscape of Broadway would be without him, it would be far, far more depressing in that there would be a preponderance of only revivals and adaptations of um, hit, hit movies. I mean, no one's doing, you know, the kind of work that Kevin, that turns him on and that he has the courage to, you know, actually uh, make, make happen. So yeah, I'm, I'm unbelievable grateful to be in in that in that sphere yeah we at can, all we cannot sing his praises enough because he is one of a kind and he's changing yep. the field hey thanks for watching the video if you enjoyed it please be sure to like it and feel free to share it and if you're new to this page click on my face and subscribe and uh, also please make sure to leave a comment and let me know what you want to hear more about in the world of Cabarabia Broadway jazz pop the new Barbra Streisand record, whatever you want to talk about. <laughs>